And we're back with another uh, episode of Banished. Megamod. Uh, Rania Dan mentioned in the comments last video that uh, you need to actually adjust these values and now that I see it, I actually see it. <laughs> so thanks Dan, uh, if it's okay to call you Dan. Um, can I, uh, okay, not by quantity, by name, uh, not flower, thank you, but if we could get all of these out of storage, that would be great, and I was actually planning on doing something with moving all the wool that we have, right, we're currently making um i think exclusively wool and leather coats all right so if there is a significant decrease in the number of coats we have well clothes we have then uh, we know if uh, people can use it or not and also i want all the peacoats in here. That should be yeah, good enough. Also, another thing we should consider starting maybe seed oil surstroming surstroming and chicken. Um I think we're good. Um another thing I actually really want is one of these treaters that is a lot of seeds trader now you might say well you already have plenty of traders to which i respond yeah but i really want seeds all right so it looks like till over here should be fine we're getting a steady income of stone now and what I would actually like to see pretty soon Alright, what do you have? Cured leather, tinware, warm coats, wool Not really Thanks No thanks And Might want to demolish this, to be honest. And right, we. I just want to remove all the resources here. I'm sorry. It's gonna look ugly for a while. It's a manual cleanup when people have time, and by the looks of it, they might have time pretty soon. They're transporting a lot of flowers. The perfumery still seems to have flowers. We'll see in a while, I guess. I'm gonna go ahead and wager that, first off, we need another one of these. Hmm. All right, I think we want to remove... Oh god. Dry goods supplier, old town trading posts. All right, just move all the perfume. Zero it out. And over here, it's... Uh, That's good. Food reserves are holding up pretty well. Mm. 
This is about to get a lot more iron ore because there's iron ore in here. Five hundred and twelve. That is a particular value. I wonder if they switched from merchants carry five hundred to five hundred and twelve in the, this uh, mod. Hmm. Programmers are gonna do programmer things, I guess. So we would need building supplies. And homewares. And the question is, do we want fancy building supplies or what? And I guess we have to consider building up some stuff. Homewares. And we're not going to be working those yet, but I would like to get a little bit more familiar with how it works. This is actually, wait, this is actually producing like over 1600 in trade value. That's pretty good. I think it's pretty good indeed. Perfume is piling up. They are building and cutting and doing stuff. Really, no iron ore yet. Do you have some salt? Which means we could preserve things. Now, oh, building supplies have a lot of options, but they're mostly bricks or glass, brick and lumber. What I don't like a lot about lumber is that, uh, about bricks is that it requires industrial fuel, which I'm not quite ready to provide. I guess glass also requires uh, industrial fuel. Medieval kiln. Does this require industrial fuel? Let's let's find out. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Cool. Homewares. Furniture. Fancy furniture. And some form of wear. We do have rugs. We have a hundred rugs. But I think the best choice would be silverware. Maybe. Pewter. Okay. I wasn't aware they made stuff out of pewter. And I'm not quite sure what it is, but I'm probably gonna end up googling it. Okay, this uses clay and firewood. Construction limit 200. Construction limit 200. I'm gonna say you're gonna stop working for now. And you are gonna start working. Now, this is a tidal pool, but we can get those materials by getting a shore house. What's the difference between a shore house and a shore hut? Hut is smaller. Got it. And there's also, like, probably the. The shore house is probably a little bit more efficient. That's also why we're going with it. Uh, 
and that's no bueno. Well, pains me to do this, but we're doing it. Oh, another boat arrives. Fishing gear. Friesian cow. Healing oil. Does healing oil actually help? No. Do gemstone tools actually help? I, I don't know about this, chief. Alright, seeds. Hops, pepper, ginger, peas, lemon, potato, and broccoli. Well, I guess we should get rid of some of this perfume. Uh, we're gonna try to total it out around 8,000, give or take a little bit. Um, I don't know if hops are great. Do you want one ginger and some sort of tree? So no broccoli. Uh, I don't know how suitable orange is for this climate. Mm. We'll just get date. Date is also doesn't sound like it's very likely. Let's get lemon. Um. How's this? A little bit more, huh? Okay, let's trade. Yay, we have seeds now. Oh, apparently. So, uh, next time we're going to try to set up a little bit of agriculture, see how that works out. Try to maybe adjust um, how many people. Yeah, it's going to be an exploratory adventure. I'm not sure if uh, the mod rebalances um, the actual... Um, like normal ratios that you would have but yeah thank you very much for watching i hope you had a great time and i'll catch you guys next time